All right, Husman RL5 door replacement. First up, you gotta remove this plug down here. If you try to get it off with it, it's going to uh, break it right off. Just like so, save the screws. If you had got it, use the insulated screwdriver. So now you open the door all the way, and you see how that splits like so. It's made in such a way that you just pry it up like that, then you can come over to the other side, pry up the other side too. And it comes right off like that. Now you have that pin at the top, and you're going to Lily. You can see that lip, the Lily's just gonna pry it with your screwdriver all the way down, and then you're gonna open the door while you do it, and you're gonna We'll rotate the door towards you and gently lower it to the ground and it should pop out of that base thing. It would be impossible for me to videotape but I'll show you it after. You see it just popped out like that. We're going to put the new one right in that hole. You see that hole? That hole is what's going to keep that tensioning screw in order to keep tension on it. If you want, you can clean this with the greaser. Um, so I ended up having to pull out the, the pin by coming from this angle and prying down and using this as leverage and that's what did it. So I'm going to clean this with this degreaser and put in the new one so you start by angling the corner down like there like the door is open and then you put it up you got to push down this pin just like you did before and then but this time you're putting it in place okay so obviously the door is in now so now you're going to see this little lip thing you're going to push this down slide it in there and you're going to see that it's going to kind of fit like that you're going to take your screwdriver and just kind of pop it on over it's kind of hard to show on camera and then it'll you get the idea. Okay, just want to show you when you put on the door, the screw holes underneath the gasket. Okay. Also, I just want to show you that this hexagonal nut needs to fit in that little tray thing down there. You can see this is the new one right there. And so you want to uh, make sure that that's clean with degreaser. So now I'm going to tension it, and um, what you want to tension it, in my opinion, is you got to pick up one of these uh, half-inch thin wrenches, and you're just going to turn it a little bit, and it's going to uh, it's going to tension it. So you're just going to like turn, one turn, and then you're going to open it. See how it feels. See that? That closed pretty good. So. Yeah, so what you want to do is you want to kind of bring it all the way out, let it go, let it go, bring it just a little bit out, just a touch, just a touch. That's good to go, that's tension good. So it's connected up top, that pin's in place, it's in place down here, this is screwed back in, the door closes, yeah, we're good to go. Yeah, so that's how you do it. Please uh, like, subscribe. Uh, hit the bell and all that also in there there's a little spring in there that sometimes flies out i don't know if you can see it and that's just how this works there's literally just the spring and this put it in that's it so yeah that's how you do it